This is a pretty basic video, but I wanted to share with you how I'm making the whoosh type build sounds in a track that I've been working on. So what I've done is to use a long recording of a train pulling into Stratford Station in London. And the original file was much longer. And this is a crop section of that original file. But what I've done is gone into the clips volume envelope and drawn some fade ins, obviously at points where I want there to be like builds in the track. And what I like here is that the naturally occurring changes in the train sound will add some variation to the builds throughout the different points in the track. Um, it's a really simple idea, but I find it effective. I prefer to use this sort of technique as opposed to always using white noise from a synth. And I've just added some other effects just to make it a bit more interesting. And this is how it sounds. And another quick idea on how I like to use long samples is um, here I've just made a quick drum and snare pattern and I've um, used the same recording of the train for this just for the purpose of the video. And again, I've just automated the clips volume envelope and made a hi-hat pattern. So you get some, you know, you get some natural variation in the sound. So yeah, this is probably not the best sound in the world, but you get the idea of, of what I'm getting at here.